thank you for joining us today with Eat with Hola. So you guys, today we got some shrimp. I just wanted to just have some a little, well, it's not different, but I love seafood so I can't help myself. We got some king crab here. We got eggs. I really wanted those eggs. I don't know why, but. And then we got some sauce here. A little sauce I hooked up. This is my own sauce. Um, and I made a potato for her. Because I know she likes potatoes. So. Only one for her. <laughs> I'm good. I got my water bottle. I don't know if you can see it or not. Here. Um. We're going to say grace and get it again. Heavenly Father, Lord, we thank you for this food we're about to receive today. And let, there be, let it be nourishing to our bodies so that we can use it as we are. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. I just like the sign right here. Love. Really. It's important. It's really, really important to love people. I know this part too. I'm hungry today. I haven't ate all day. But really, love is important. Just like the Bible say, love your neighbor as though you love yourself. And I know that sounds harder than it is, but it's easy if you love. If you love and you have the love in your heart. As a matter of fact, I went to an interview today. And me, myself, I just feel like love is important i love to help people and when i say i love it's real because i volunteer to do things that shows love i just love when people are happy with the ending the outcome of whatever it is that i'm displaying to them so it's just important to love others I have a few people on here that I'm kind of close to, and I'm on their lives all the time. It's like, the reason I do that is because I love what they're doing, you know, and I love her too. I love her. I love her too. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's just that I, if. If I love you, you know it. Some people can say, I love you, and you don't even know it. But I love and show love. Anyway, I know I'm rambling on. I'm going to start eating. Because I'm hungry. Look at this big potato. Ooh, yes, I love red potatoes. It's going to be you, though. No, it's not. I can eat some if you want to. I'm starting to pray. All right. Mm -hmm. One kid and I could eat seafood every night. For real. My husband, like, <clears throat> I can't mean? smell nothing. Yeah, <laughs> that part. And it's always smell like seafood in here. Mm hmm. <clears throat> I'm trying to get him to do more with me. He kind of <clears throat> camera shy. Oh, no. He a little bit. But it's okay. He get better. Yeah, he will. <clears throat> and I'm definitely going to encourage it. I don't want nothing left in here. I'm just saying, I will tear these things up. You gotta give me some of that because this is looking like this one. Here you can have it. You hey. got two big ones. How you gonna just take my crab? Give me this one. Y'all, we gotta show that love, okay? <laughs> this one, small one. I didn't take it all and say I'm gonna it's eat it. It's okay. Though. But I'm gonna show her the love. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> oh, that was a you know, good one. 
God is good. <laughs> All the time. All the time, God is good. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. I know a lot of people look at Valentine's Day as um, this day when every man should be just displaying love, displaying love, but I used to do that too. I ain't even gonna lie. It was like, you need to be doing this for me. You need to be doing that for me. But some people don't get it because Valentine's Day is every day. It's not just for it's not just February the fourteenth. And some people be just be like, Oh no, it's just one day. Well and I so know you, you be showing me love just one day. One day. Mm 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 mm. The devil is a lie. Right. If you show me one day of love, then you're not the right person for me. Exactly. Because it's not about just this day. Right. It's an ongoing thing. <clears throat> and most people who are getting showed that love every day, they don't care about this day. Valentine's right? Day don't mean a whole bunch of stuff. Right. Yeah. Uh, Let's talk about new relationships. Oh, <clears throat> uh, don't. Why you gotta start that conversation? Because it's necessary. It is necessary. Because when you first in the relationship, mm -hmm. and Valentine's Day may come like six months into that relationship, or maybe five, mm -hmm. and. Your expectations are set at he better be doing this, he better be doing that, what you want. And this guy don't know what you want, have not been there with you before, don't know what you expect from Valentine's Day, mm -hmm. and don't do nothing. Say he don't call you, he don't talk to you that day. Um... Then you feeling like, I'm done. Mm -hmm. Dang, I don't want to have nothing to do with him. He didn't call me in the morning. Day ain't over yet. He ain't called me this morning. He ain't said, um, happy Valentine's Day. Mm -hmm. All this different stuff. And I'm, all, I'm only saying this because I've already been here. Been here, done that. And... Tell him how old are you again? I'm 54. I've never told him. But today you get to know 54. And coming. Lord say the same. 54. 54. Hello. I'm not mad about my age. I am so happy to be the age I am. I ain't going to get on that right now. Keep but. Mm -hmm. Um. You look at this person as you already should know what I want. <clears throat> I want this, I want that. And I get it. We as women, we already got our expectations. We want what we want. This is what we expect from a man. And it's not happening. Like it says. Men are from Mars, women are from Venus. They don't know us. They do not know us. Huh. <clears throat> and it's real. Even me and my husband. If he was here right now, he'll tell you we didn't know each other. How long did y'all how long did y'all um date until y'all got married? Two years. That's I great. thought it was too long. <laughs> I was like, what? Some people can't go that long. They be like, um, I need to be in a relationship right Right, now. right, right. And I'm, I was, I was, I was that person. I was like, mm, come on, let's do this. We, we had no sex. We didn't do anything until Did we you, got married. But y'all kissed though, right? We kissed. Just didn't have no sex. We kissed and hugged and. You know, went there, it was like, mm, gotta go home. Bye. We didn't do So when you first met him, like, how was it? Like, was it like, oh my gosh, he's the one? Like, how do you know 
if that person is really for you. Okay. So I'm gonna give it 100. When so, I first met him, mm -hmm. I was like, uh uh, that's not my husband. I'm a, you know, I go to church, I'm a Christian woman. I was praying to God to, you know, do what he needs to do to find that person for me. Mm -hmm. And I went to church, this and that, went to another church that I don't normally go to. And I, you know, the spirit said, that's your husband. I seen him in his weakest, in a weak spot. I ain't gonna say his weakest, but it was a weak spot. And I was like, the girl that invited me to church was sitting next to me and she, I was telling her, I was like, you need a hug, go, go hug him. And she did. Didn't think nothing after that. Went, was continuing going to church. And then he started to say, talk to me and stuff. And here and there, he gave me rides to church. My car situation was not good. So anyway, that's where it started from church. And ever since then, he can't leave you alone. Mm -hmm. And ain't nobody, ain't nobody, I'm just saying. Nobody's going to be perfect. We all know that. But there's some things you deal with, some things you don't. It's up to you to decide on what you can and what you can't deal with. What you can work with and what you can't. First of all, I know this girl right here, me right here, ain't perfect. <laughs> Not <laughs> far from perfect. And I know there's some work that I needed to do with myself. So if he was willing to work with me and accept that, mm -hmm. I knew it was all good. Because I'm not perfect. Not by far. I was scorned. Been in a marriage before. Scorned, like I said. And he was willing to do that with me. So, And now... He can't get rid of me. No, he can't. He and I him. can't get rid of him. I'm not. I won't. Yeah, you, know, you should hear him. Mom, I want him. <laughs> That's my woman. It's so funny because my grandkids all say it. That's your corny, my honey. Instead of saying papa, papa they say, and he be like, no, I'm your papa. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny, but they call him Papa automatically. He he just he, he crazy just about him. them and mm -hmm. they crazy about him. Don't mess with Papa. Don't mess with her Papa, especially my granddaughter. She's like, uh, mess with my Papa, we got a problem. All right, y'all. But I just think love is. Is important. It's important. And you need to know what you will and what you won't deal with. It's it's just not about you all the time because you're not going to find that person that is perfect for you. There's going to be some things that you have to make him understand that you will and will not deal with. Mm -hmm. And if he's not willing to do that, keep it pushing. Keep it pushing. But you got to let him know in the beginning... So you understand each other. And you know what? To be totally honest, my husband, I learned so much from my first marriage. Ooh, look at that shrimp right there. But I did. I learned a lot. And that shrimp is huge. It's huge, huh? All of them are like that. Tell you. Woohoo, we finna go in. Look at this. The most, what's it called? The most? I guess. I call it the knuckles. Yeah. The knuckle muscles. But whatever. that's the best part of the crab. Mm -hmm. Some people don't like that. I don't get it. Anyway. Mm -hmm. I am. Um, Continue. I am um, up front. After my first marriage, I let him know. I don't like this. I don't like that. And I felt myself. I like, oh my God, I'm being so crazy. But then I was like, no, you're not. 
You know, if some of these things he understand about me, not him. I'm not telling him to go change yourself and you be like this, you be like that. I'm letting him know how I am and my do's and don'ts. And he was like, okay, okay, I can deal with that. Thank you. Um, even though he may not have been used to it, slowly but surely things started to change and you know, I seen it, everybody else seen it. They'd be like, he just, even her, she would say, he just do everything for you. You're just spoiled. Mm -hmm. And I'm thinking, no, you're not. He's not doing everything. She is spoiled. But it was true. He did. He, he tried to accommodate everything I needed. Mm -hmm. And that part, it's not like, it's not about, oh, I, I. I don't want to train him. I don't want to tell him what to do. It's not about if that. you don't, let me say this, ladies, single ladies, and you getting a man or you dating, it's about training because he's going to train you what he likes. You need to train him what he likes. You know, that's a give and take thing. It's not about begging. It's not about saying, I don't want him because I got to tell him what to do. He don't know what you want. He's just learning. He's learning you. Mm -hmm. You. <laughs> not the next woman. Not you. the woman before that. Not the woman before that. But you. Right there. That's watching. You. <laughs> you hear that? I ain't going to even say it. <laughs> next. 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 <laughs> <laughs> And if you don't want that man, then I get it. But you do have to tell them how to treat you. How to treat. How to treat. Who oh, no. knew? <laughs> you. Mm. How to treat you. He might be treating you. You, women, is the same thing. I said women. Well, okay. She said women. Oh, that's that's pretty much it. You got to teach him how to treat you. Because we all are not the same. Mm -mm. And people want to say that, but I don't think so. I ain't the same as no other woman. I'm me. I'm one of a kind. And that's how I feel about me. I'm one of a kind. Like that? I, yes. Like, like that. Uh, uh, like, like that. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> For real, mm -hmm. though. You know what I'm saying? I'm one of a kind. Yeah, you need to know me. Did y'all see that? Uh -huh. She was like, like uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Okay. Seriously. My husband probably think I'm crazy as I'll get out, but <laughs> you know, he know me. And that's what I want him to understand. Me. Me, 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 me. me. That's how you look at that. Well, y'all, yeah, she really is for you, though. Yeah, whatever. She get whatever she wants. No, I don't know about that. And she be complaining. I don't know what you complaining for. Uh, okay. So, Diddy, we not going to go on that. <laughs> because. Y'all, I have, I will tell y'all about it later. But anyways, <laughs> I'm going to get my own YouTube channel, so make sure. Yes. Oh, don't worry. We going to hook her up. And we going to set her up in our my comments. Where her channel is there and you guys could turn on to her because she is going to get her own channel and do her own thing. Oh, my own thing. Mm -hmm. And we'll be collabing and doing things together. Mm -hmm. I also have an aunt <clears throat> that really got me started. And her channel is a, um, no, Entertainment A. M S O R Entertaining Entertaining A S M R. But and then she always you gonna put it in the comments, right? Yeah, she'll be in my comments mm -hmm. too. Check her out. She's good. Subscribe and hit that bell for her. Hit that bell, 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 bell. She's really good, y'all. So She's make good. sure you watch all her videos. She's really good. Uh huh. Again, she got me started, so. And me and her collab a lot too. So, and we'll be doing more. 
Just to sell. We ain't going nowhere yet, though. We got a lot of food. Oh, I eat. forgot the A. In the front. Mm, mm, mm. And that's the best part. That's what I wanted yeah. so bad was an egg. Oh, I love it. I like to break mine up a little bit. Put mm. this egg up in here. Woo! And this stuff is kind of mm. hot right here. This sauce. Y'all, I have to admit, my sauce is pretty good. It's really good. Mm. Mm. If you don't know, now you know. Okay. Now you know. See that drip? Ooh. Did anyway. some of my egg fall in there? Yeah. <laughs> it's all good though. Mine too. Well, I'm just a little bit. Yeah, this is really good. Oh, we've been doing a lot of talking. And not a whole lot of eating. But. <clears throat> I just wanted to do that today. I'm going to holler at y'all for a minute. Give me these lemons. I forgot about those lemons. Some egg. Some of the sauce on here. Drizzle a little bit of this egg. Drizzle. Drizzle. drizzle it's drizzle. a drizzle, drizzle, drizzle. Lemon drizzle. That's what that's called. Lemon right drizzle. Lemon. That's what I call it. The lemon, lemon drizzle. The lemon drizzle. You didn't put no lemon drizzle on it. Let me try this lemon drizzle. Yeah. Go on, put some of that lemon drizzle. Mmm. Lemon drizzle. Right. It better be good, too. Drip, drip, drip. Came through dripping? Dripping. Came through dripping. Dripping. Hey. 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 Oh, my goodness. My granddaughter was down here. She'll be doing a whole nother way. Mmm. That was good with you. I told you. Mmm. Put some on your potato, though. I ain't kidding. It's like a potato. I'm bringing no corn out today. Make no corn. Mmm. 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 But that's good. good I don't know if y'all know, but I can eat seafood every day. So, me and my homegirls, we was thinking about going to eat some seafood today at lunch. But then, I changed my mind. I'm like, 30 minutes not going to do nothing. Oh, no. Not even an hour. So, I'm like, I'm going to just pass. And guess what? The Lord blessed me today. <clears throat> okay. See? He said, just wait. Just, just wait. wait. Just wait. And guess what I got? Some safe bolts. Hey, right. You ain't got to rush yourself eating it. I can eat it. Put it in a, uh, the, what's, what's it called? Doggy bag. Doggy bag and dip. Right. You can just eat it. Sit right here. Who came up with the lemon drizzle? With the little Who dip? Who do you think came up with it? You did that's what I just said, right? Okay. Let's see if it's good with the potato. It is. What do you think? That's good. That's good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's good. I got a bunch left in here, but let's, let's see. Let's see how much I got in here. I'm going to go ahead and put some lemon up on here. Y'all, other than that, everybody day was good. I hope so. I hope y'all day was good. Cause yeah. I have my day is fantastic. Now I got some seafood in my in my system. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Even going on an interview. It's a good interview. I just. Ask God to do what he do. Mm -hmm. If it's meant to be, it'll happen. If it ain't, I am not one. No, she not. She mm. ain't worried. Try again. <laughs> I'm not in no rush, you know. 
pad over. <clears throat> now I didn't know where I Mmm, y'all, this is really good. It is so, so good. And I'm not even playing. It's not because I made it. It's because... Mm. Mm hmm. Woo! My hair be in the way. I don't want to touch my hair, so you know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't get no crab and hair in your food. Yeah. I know one thing. I have not had not one shrimp. Have you? We had no one shrimp. I did not eat no shrimp. Once you did, you ate that big one. I didn't. See? Mmm, cute. You that like it? No, that ain't it. It's that one. It's this one. Woo! Oh. All of them are big. That was the jumbo one. This one is like, are they all jumbo though? This one is like the biggest one out of all the jumbo ones. I am going to eat it. I am. I'm going to let her get that one. <laughs> <laughs> she gonna let me do that. I'm good. Cause I'm gonna take some lemon, squirt it on here. I'm, yeah, I'm gonna do it like that right there. I like to suck it off before, yeah. And then I'm gonna take the shell off. Y'all feel me? I don't know. Oh, <laughs> I had it just right. But these right here are like bomb. You see it? Look at this. I'm gonna pull it up. And I get these at our local store. Yeah, some people get them from Costco. I haven't seen them at Costco. Did I get some um crabs in my hair? Mm -hmm. Yeah, no crabs in there. No. Look at that. See? It's huge. I know my camera be tripping sometimes, so I'm going to hold it there. All right. Y'all got it? All right, because I'm going to eat it. Mm -mm -mm. Would you one of them and do like that? Suck all the juice off of it first. Don't choke yourself. Because I did that before. That was not nice at all. Went down the wrong pipe. Oh, yeah. Woo! But I got this. Uh huh. Mm. Yes, Lord. Mm, mm. Mm -hmm. Then you take the shell off. Oh, my goodness. You guys. Mm. Girl, you did your thing. I am so thankful. Thank you. I am just thankful. Thankful, thankful, thankful. For another day. When my husband becomes his girlfriend, I can put that And on top of everything, I got my um, kids, a girl, day, 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 day. day, day. This is day day. I know y'all see me in my other <laughs> It's my girl for life. Day day. She ain't got no choice. Yeah, I don't care if she don't like me or not. She still ain't got no choice. You like me? <laughs> <laughs> she said, y'all get you see how the way she looked at me? She's like, you like me? You better say yeah. Mm -mm. <laughs> It is what it is. Whether she say yes or no, I'm that person. And you have no choice. You feel me? You feel me? Which one is it? Bum, bum, bum. Diggity. 
Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know, my daughter, she work at Olive Garden, and I feel for her right now. Because, <laughs> you know, that place is packed. Yeah. They be packed. Yeah, they be having a lot of people up in there. Making some good tips. Mm-hmm. That was good. Mm -mm. You better get busy. Because we got more to eat. More to eat. More to eat. More love. <clears throat> Are you going to eat some of that potatoes? Oh, you don't want it? Mm -mm. I ate half of it. Let's get on that. Okay. Eat that with the um with the lemon mm -hmm. drizzle. Mm -hmm. Just pour it. We'll be all set. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You think I want? You eat all your crab? No. You didn't eat all your crab? I said you. I don't know why I didn't eat all mine. I only got like two more left. Well, um, I'm going to eat this one. Okay. So. The other day. What's well, Valentine's Day, okay? So. A lot of people get irritated because they don't get gifts. I can, I can, I can really relate to people who <clears throat> just don't get nothing ever <laughs> at all. <laughs> they husband just don't care. I get those people who mad because they didn't get anything. I get. You talk about the people that always get stuff. Hmm. I'm just saying. And they might get, may get stuff, may not. <clears throat> I'm just talking about. Oh, I hate when I do that. That hurts my thumb. Anyway, you all right? I'm so good. Okay. It didn't hurt that bad. <laughs> the way you say it. Uh -huh. like, oh. <laughs> I don't know. So dramatic. So dramatic. But. Some people get where they feel like, oh my God, he didn't give me nothing for Valentine. He didn't give me nothing. My thing is, <clears throat> tell me what you got for Valentine's Day. <laughs> but, okay, I'm going to tell you what I got. I got 12 roses and candy seeds candy, which is my favorite, favorite, favorite candy. I don't eat. I don't. No, I'm not going to say I don't eat store-bought candy. I was just about to say yes, you But know. C's candy is my ultimate favorite. I will eat this. Now, if you buy me a candy bar, it's going to take me a while to eat that candy bar. I'll take a little piece, put it on my nightstand. Here and there. Take a little piece, mm -hmm. eat some more. But C's, I'm going to eat. That's just how I am about it. But anyway, my husband bought me what I love. And he bought me roses and I love flowers. I'm that type of person. Give me my flowers while, while I'm, I'm here. Alive. Yes, while I'm alive. So I can see them and smell them. If you give them to people when they dead, what the heck? They don't know. They don't know nothing about that. They gonna look at you if like, they okay. sell you, they like flowers, give it to them. For real. So, my point is... There are people who like these things, like flowers, like that. If there's any man out there and a woman tells you she likes flowers, she likes candy, she likes you to do certain things, do it. If you love that woman, do it. 
She's not just saying it for her health. <laughs> that part. I'm not too much a flower person like that. Like, it's pretty, but... They die. Yeah. We get that too. I That's why I bought you some wooden ones. Yeah, I like those. I was grateful for those. <laughs> and guess what? I got some, um, what is it called? Bath bombs. Mm -hmm. So... That was so beautiful. I try to get things that you can use. Or different. I bought you flowers before. Mm -hmm. And they were regular flowers. They They're died. like roses. Like, yeah. But these don't die. You can keep them forever and they're pretty. Who bought me those? A brand? A brand. My daughter bought me mm -hmm. um, wooden flowers. And they. I love them. I still got them. That was probably two, 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 three years ago. Years. Really? Yeah. It's been that long? Yes. I had them before we moved here, which has been yeah, about three years ago. Okay. Yeah. So if y'all have any problems with buying flowers, make sure you got the wooden ones. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you just do what the person that you love likes. And... Who's to say that you might be able to do it all the time? Just showing them your love. Okay. Let's let's talk about this. Okay, so men sometimes, even women, they might be able to pay the bills, take care of everything, husband or wife, do all that. But and that's awesome. Let me tell you, when you find a man or a woman who's taking care of the house, you got you a good person there that really cares for you. And I say that because if they're doing that, if there's some type of love there. They ain't putting you out every month. They ain't putting you out every week. You know, they're not saying, hey, you got to go. I'm paying the bills here. Da, 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 da. Then you know. That person's care for you. Men are different from women. Men show, a lot of men, a lot of men, not all men, show they love by things they do like that. They, mm -hmm. they take care of the bills. They might put gas in your car. They might go to the store, buy you a soda, whatever that is. And they may not buy you a Valentine's present. And they feel like, I'm showing you love. What are you talking about? I don't love you. But sometimes you want to see it different. Right. You want to say, well, why don't you buy me flowers? It's my birthday. You didn't buy me a present. You know? And that part, it's like, I don't know. You know what I mean? Some people's different. Some women are different. For me, it's not about that. It's, it's grown because back in the day, I'd be like, you need to buy me a present. You right. need to pay the bill. You need <laughs> Where my water at? <laughs> you know? Why you didn't fix me a plate? You right. know, all that kind of thing. Where's my breakfast? Back in the day. Why are you just cooking you some potatoes and, and you didn't and cook toast, me nothing? And I get some cereal and milk. I got to fix my own cereal and milk on top of that. Right. Right. Okay, we getting interrupted by my granddaughter right here. Mommy, yeah. I want to make this video too. Okay, so my daughter want to make this okay, video she's, too. Okay, her video's after our video. Yes. We got you, baby, okay? You going to make your video next, okay, baby? Mm -hmm. Go get your stuff ready. Go get your toys so Go we can get your ready. video ready, okay? Sorry yeah. about that. We got to get her ready too. She got to make her video too. Yes. So, she mad. So anyway, that's just, you know, we all got our little differences. Yes, we do. Us as women, we got some issues. Women, we got issues. Mommy, Men be like, that's fine. Get some more. Um, but anyway. Mm -hmm. um, we just 
I just look at it as sometimes as women, we go too far. We do. We go too far and we're ready to just settle everything because we're not happy with what's happening with us. It's not always about um, us. We got to think about the other person and their feelings and what they want to. We're being very selfish. It is. It definitely is. We're being selfish when we just think, me, 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 me. It's no, 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 no. It's not all about me. It's we got to be a team. We got to figure out things together and what's going to make him happy and what's making us happy. And trust me, I had to learn that. You don't want to learn the hard way. I'm ready. Make sure we're listening. Okay? Mm -hmm. What you say? Put your stuff right there and get your babies. Johnny, Johnny. Yes, Papa. Papa's easy chick. No, no Papa's. Open your mouth. Ha, ha, ha. I said, don't make you big. I'll make you baby too. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's my granddaughter. Proof. With that note, you guys, we're going to end this video. Make okay. sure you comment, subscribe, and hit the bell. Okay. Okay. Don't you like your kid make a video. And I listen don't. to what she said. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. Bye. Love you guys. And remember, love what you eat. <laughs> love what you eat.